Hey, my name's Zach, and I wanted to show you how to upload your own images so you can make icons. So, here I am on this website here. Now if I scroll down, I have an online icon converter right here. Typically it's set for icon for Windows 7, since I'm running Windows 8. You can choose any file here by clicking Choose File. I have a bunch of images here, and let's do the little robot. If I right click, go to Properties, you can see this is a pretty big image. It's a JPG, or JPEG is the same, or JPEG. And we'll hit Open. And now all I have to do is hit Download. I hit Download. It uploads here and downloads almost instantly. If I click here and hit Show in Folder, I'm going to move this to my desktop. Now if I minus that and I right click again and go to Properties, you can see it's a much, much smaller file. And close out of that. Now comes the most important part. It's always good practice to keep your icons in the same folder. Thus, if they're not in the right location, the icon doesn't know where to direct it. So your icons actually wouldn't work if you accidentally deleted the file or moved it to a different location. So I'll show you what I mean over here. I already have an item set up in my documents. So icons here. So I double click that. And I have two icons that I have one on my desktop here. And it's actually a folder. So I can click this icon and leave it with my others. And let's say I wanted to change this folder. I would right click, go to properties, customize, change icon, browse, and into my documents folder and then icons and select the robot. Say open, OK, and apply. I say OK. I can close out of this. And as you can see, I now have a robot icon and an openable folder. My name's Zach, and I just showed you how to upload your own images so you could make icons. Thanks for watching. Thank you.